Yo, my friends, what's up? It's 11 o'clock. Um, my apartment's right over there. Saxby's is right here. 7-Eleven is right there. Just felt like I should give you kind of like a scenery of what I'm looking out towards. And um, you're, you're resting on a, a plant, so whew, let's get going. Where should I start? The last two weeks have been challenging for me, especially the last two weeks. Ugh, it's kind of cold out. It's like 40 something degrees. Florida boy is going home tomorrow. But yeah, the last two weeks have been challenging and I, I don't wanna blame it on COVID. I don't like complaining about COVID. I don't like complaining about the everything about it you know it's just that's what life is so i try not to complain about it but right now i'm gonna rant i'm gonna i'm gonna spill what's on my mind um as i've said last few weeks have been challenging i feel like i just you know i, I there are things to look forward to but for my whole life i've always had hockey to look forward to and the season and just games you know practices um if it weren't if covid wasn't happening i'd have a practice tomorrow morning at 6 a.m i'd have to wake up at 4 45 for that practice preparing tonight getting to sleep early you know not the case not the case right now you know, I, I would have looked forward to many games in the past, like, five, six, seven weeks. You know, I've had, I'd probably have two games a weekend. I haven't played a hockey game since February. I miss it so much. Just, I miss playing hockey. I miss going to parties. I miss going out, meeting new people. You know, I, do I meet new people? Yes, I've met new friends, and I'm, I'm happy that I met new people. Um, going to restaurants, just being able to just live and not have to worry about wearing a mask or, you know, if somebody has COVID or not, just, I miss it. I really miss it. Um, I miss playing hockey, you know, just, it's been hard for me, honestly last few weeks have been hard uh you know remaining positive and when times are tough um like that's that's what i just try to stick towards you know like that's that's what i try to do you know like what are you gonna do to change yourself how are you going to focus on the positives um, you know, what music am I, like, I like to ask myself, like, what music am I listening to? What am I doing when I wake up? You know, and recently I've been sleeping in. You know, recently I haven't been waking up so early, especially this past weekend. And same with today. Like, today I woke up at, I think, 11. I, this past weekend, I don't think I woke up before 11 or 11.30 for that matter. So... Um, you know, I look at this as a good thing. I look at this as just life. You know, there are going to be times in life where I'm going to be not as happy and not as boom, 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 let's go, yeah, as I normally am. And that's okay. It's just how it is. But right now, I am feeling that, you know, sadness, I guess. I don't feel sorry for myself for one second. <laughs> I don't feel sorry for myself at all. There's nothing to feel sorry for. But, I mean, I wake up every single day and I'm alive. You know, when I obviously, when I wake up, I'm alive. No shit, Zach. But what I, what I mean is, like, I, I have this life. You know, I have this one life that I've been so... I don't know. I don't want to say luck. I don't want to say luck. What am I? Fortunate? Like, the odds are the odds of life are 400 trillion to one. Like, holy shit. That's crazy. 
thank you mom and dad for you know whatever I'm not, I don't need to say it you guys know what I want to say but just it's just so crazy that I'm alive on earth and I have a heartbeat that beats that's fucking insane and to be living in 2020 with YouTube you know I wouldn't be able to post this without YouTube just having the luxuries that I have the family that I have support you know I I'm grateful for all of it and I'm going home tomorrow I'm gonna use it as like a reset I'm going to treat the next four or five weeks similarly to how I treated it in the early COVID days. Wake up at a reasonable hour, get to work, grind. Make, make it fun for myself, you know, make life fun. Do what makes me happy, you know, and, and just play some hockey outside on the sports court. Uh, things have been challenging though things really have been challenging for me mentally mentally you know I have I have all the privilege in the world like I have so much privilege um, you know and there's a lot of people that have it way worse than I do ten times worse than I do and I don't want to take away from that I'm just you know mentally it's been hard it's been hard but we'll battle through We'll battle through. Not gonna let this fucking stop me. Not gonna let it stop me. Life's good. Life's good. And I think that maybe I'll change best day to something else. You know, right now it, it doesn't really resonate with me as much as it did in the past. Maybe I'll change it to like day. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. I'm I'm I think change change is a superpower. Being able to change your mind. Um I think Gary Vee might have put that in my brain. That change is a superpower. I don't know if he did, but if he did, thanks Gary. Appreciate it. <laughs> oh my god. So it's seven minutes and forty one seconds right now and I'm just kind of letting it out letting it out and I'm not going to edit this video it's going to just go up as is it's going to go up as is my hands are cold they're in my little pouch Whew. tomorrow my flight's at I think like 1.30 so I'm going to leave for the airport at like 12.30 maybe a little later wow 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 just kind of taking it all in right now. Life's good, my friends. Life's good. Even in this... My phone died, so I had to come to my room and get a charger. But fucking rights. Life is good. Life is good. And I know right now is challenging. Right now is challenging for me. Right now, it's challenging for me. But... But... I'm alive and I have this life and I have this opportunity. So I need to take it. I need to take life. I need to take it. So, Zach, take it. All right. I love you all. You guys, to the, whoever it is, two people that watch these videos, three people, one person, I don't care. To Zach in 30 years, I fucking love you, bro. But... This video's got to come to an end soon, so. With that being said, I hope you all have a great night. A great fucking night. A great night. And a great day. An even better day. I love you all. I love you all. Alright? Have a great night, a great day, whenever it is you're watching this, and I'll catch you tomorrow. Peace. Peace. Peace.